Hi guys. Heaven Michael Costner is a Golden Globe and Emmy Award-winning American actor. He has been in two marriages and has dated many Hollywood stars. Here is their list. Kevin Costner and Cindy Silva met in 1976 while studying at the university. On their first official date, Costner introduced Cindy to his parents on the same night. They dated for some years before Kevin proposed to her. Wedding was held on February 11, 1978. Their union produced three children, Annie Clayton, 1984, Lily McCall, 1986, and Joe Tedrick, 1988. Unfortunately, the couple divorced in December 1994 after 16 years of marriage. Silva accused her ex-husband of unfaithfulness and claimed he could not balance his busy schedule and family. Kevin later cited that Silva was the better person in their relationship, describing her as smart, sweet, and beautiful. However, he added that the temptations of fame affected their relationship negatively. Cynthia was reportedly uncomfortable with her husband's raunchy movie scenes and had given him an ultimatum to stop playing those roles or quit the industry. In 1996, after his split from first wife Kevin Costner had to admit to a brief romance with another woman involved in the sports world, Bridget Rooney is the niece of the late Dan Rooney, who owned the Pittsburgh Steelers football team at the time. And while not much is known about how long Costner and the socialite were together or why they split, it is known that their tryst led to Costner's fourth child, son Liam, now 27 though he allegedly acknowledged Liam only after Rumi insisted on a paternity test. Costner later set up a trust fund in Liam's name and saw the boy occasionally, but not on a regular basis. Kevin Costner and Elle Matferson met in 1996 and began dating shortly thereafter. Costner was public about his strong feelings for Matferson, gushing in one interview. I feel I have met my equal with this beautiful, talented, funny, and lovely person. Within months, the couple had moved in together. The single lifestyle had officially given way to domestic stability, although, unfortunately, it ended up being short-lived. The couple had split by the end of the year. Some sources say that Costner was not ready to settle down and have children, while others say that McPherson was not happy with Costner's demanding work schedule. At the peak of his fame in the mid-1990s, Costner found a new friend in Joan London, ABC's popular Good Morning America, host who manned the desk until 1997. His new relationship with the American journalist, author, and TV host was a hot story in the media, and with Waterworld promotion coinciding, the publicity proved to be too much and was eventually the cause of the relationship's breakdown. I think Kevin and I would have dated longer had it not been for the unbelievable press focus on us," London said years later. However, according to her, Costner was lavish in his romancing efforts while they were together. She recalls, He got this yacht, and we sailed around New York Harbor and had dinner. It was quite romantic and quite beautiful. In 1997, Heaven Costner met American news anchor Tawny Liu. He clearly took a liking to her, as he dated the Miss America pageant winner secretly throughout 1997 and 1998. However, not much has been revealed about their relationship. Interestingly, Costner wasn't the first celeb little dated. She had a relationship with American actor Ron Silver and late 1970s Hollywood star Burt Reynolds. An impressive track record. Kevin Costner and Birgit Cunningham dated for three years in the late 1990s. Cunningham is a British political activist and former personal assistant to a vice president of Universal Pictures. She met Costner in Los Angeles and they quickly became involved. The relationship was reportedly very passionate, but it also had its ups and downs. In 1999, Cunningham had a breakdown and after drinking a bottle of tequila became unconscious and found herself in hospital, later deciding to move back to England and the relationship with Costner ended. Yet another famous female name that can be romantically linked to Kevin Costner in the 1990s is Courtney Cox, who played the character of Monica on the hit US sitcom Friends. Their alleged fling was back in 1995 
which seems to have been a pretty busy year for Costner as he made the most of being single. Unfortunately, not much is known about this relationship, as both Costner and Cox were very secretive and kept any dates they may have had under wraps. However, Cox married David Arquette in 1999, so it was over by then. Costner and Cox reunited in 2001, but this time only on the big screen, where they co-starred in action-adventure crime movie, 3,000 Miles to Graceland. Christine Baumgartner and Kevin Costner first encountered each other in the 1980s. They crossed paths on a golf course where Costner was rehearsing for his 1996 romantic comedy Tin Cup. At the time, the actor was still married to his first wife, Cindy Silva. In 1999, Costner ran into Baumgartner at a restaurant. Recalling how their reunion went, the actor said he and Baumgartner exchanged numbers. Not long after, they started dating. In 2003, Christine Baumgartner and Hayden Costner nearly broke up due to the former's fear of having kids. Already a dad of four before dating Baumgartner, Costner said his girlfriend wanted a child. However, he had fears of being an ineffective father, which nearly cost him his relationship with Baumgartner. After reassuring himself that his love for Baumgartner was greater than his fears, Costner took the relationship to the next level. In 2004, the pair exchanged marital vows. The wedding was a storybook affair and took place on Costner's 160-acre ranch, the Dunbar in Aspen. The actor arrived in a horse-drawn carriage while Baumgartner came to the ceremony in a green vintage truck. The Dunbar, named after Costner's Dances with Wolves character, is still owned by Costner and is now available as a private wedding venue. Three years after tying the knot, Christine Baumgartner and Kevin Costner expanded their family. The former lovebirds welcomed their son, Caden, in May 2007. In February 2009, the pair's second son, Hayes, joined the family. Then in 2010, the parents welcomed their third child and daughter, Grace Avery. Baumgartner and Costner's divorce news came nearly five months shy of their 19th wedding anniversary. According to reports, the mom of three filed for divorce on May 1, 2023. In a statement, the actor's representative shared that the ex-couple parted ways due to circumstances beyond Costner's control. Regarding the reason for Baumgartner and Costner's divorce, the former cited irreconcilable differences. Meanwhile, the actor has filed his response to the divorce and is seeking joint custody of the kids. It has also been revealed that the estranged couple had a prenup and spousal support will only be paid according to the agreement.